Hey, we've got a special guest here at the B&G Sponsored Events, and we have my favorite author at the table right now, and I'm going to have her introduce herself, and we're going to talk about the excitement of what's going on with her book. Hello. Well, it's good to have you back. I always like coming here to see you guys again. She's been a very solid regular with us and keeping us busy at the B&G Sponsored Events. And uh, I can put a little plug in right now. you got to come on down and meet her. She's selling, you're selling your books yes, here, today, yes. aren't you? Well, tell us a little bit about the book. Well, the book tells my own personal story of a big trial I went through when I was 19 years old. And it's the subject is one that I wish there were books back then when it happened to me to encourage me through it. And so that's what my book is about, my unplanned pregnancy that I went through when I was 19 years old. When you were 19. Yes. Well, that's very interesting. What we were excited about was the first time we talked to you, it was a wonderful book, and now you've taken it from one step to another level. Yes. A new name, a new title, I, I understand. gave it a new title. Gave it a new a title. A few months ago. It just was on my mind to change it, and some people encouraged me. So instead of God in your pillow, it is now God in my pillow. God in my pillow. Because it's my pillow that I cried on a lot. It was uh. my pillow that I laughed on too oh okay well <laughs> laughed right i've heard from gail however she read it and said it was wonderful and some of the what are you doing with it now i understand that you're really excited you're talking about doing a uh, audiobook an audiobook yes and i'm in the process of putting one together i know a lot of people love reading books but some people love hearing books and i've been encouraged greatly to do that so I think that'll be super good. Yeah, yeah. I'm and really I, excited. And I feel it's enjoyable enough that you don't need to read it. It's understandable enough you can just hear it. Well, so. I think, you know, it's it's kind of a unique situation. When we hear words, it's like our mind then starts picturing what's actually being said and yeah. read. And you start following the story. Yeah. You feel like you're a part of the story. Fair and, enough. you know, it's it's kind of interesting because television is visual, of course. And I don't think you have to do as much thinking when you hear an audio book. Yeah. But you view more than you do when you look at a television. I agree, yeah. So and I think it'll be exciting to be able to, to hear what you have to say. And sometimes finding time, to, even though quite a few have said they couldn't put it down and they read it in one sitting or stayed up really late watching, uh, reading it. But when you don't have that time, you can hear it when you're in the car driving. Very true. And... and so I'm, I'm looking forward to trying to do this. This is it. Now, do we have another book in the future? Are you getting ready for another one? Well, I'm planning on it of another trial I went through. Uh-huh. And I'm, but I want to get, the, I want more to find this book because this is my main story. This is the main this story. This is the main story. Where is it available at now? I have it available through my own website. And you might get a little cheaper deal with that because it's directly from me. Okay. Give us, the, give us the location. Mom, my website is mariannesmemoirs.com. mariannesmemoirs.com. Since it's a memoir, I uh-huh. made sure I put that in my title of my business, mariannesmemoirs.com. So you can order it through there uh-huh. via PayPal, you know, that type of payment. Sure. Um, but it's also available on Barnes & Noble. And there's, a, there's um, quite a few. Are you on Amazon yes. also? Oh, and on Amazon, and of course, on Amazon. Yes. I'm an Amazon fanatic. I, yeah. Everything you see is Amazon. I know. That's why I assume everyone knows it's on Amazon, <laughs> so I don't forget to bring it up. Well, that's very, But yeah, very so true. there's other sources it's available. So when you put together this book, and I know it's taking a long time to do this, and you're now marketing it and yeah. working with it, what goes into the back of your mind? Do you feel like, why am I doing this? Or what's your story? What are you trying to accomplish? I'm trying to accomplish what I wish I had. I wish I had read other people's stories that was similar to what I went through, to not feel so alone, to encourage people. Mm -hmm. I, when you read it, you'll see the trials I went through, and it's not, I like to say it's not really the typical story, because it kind of starts as a soap opera, but it turns into a love story. Oh, okay. So something in the middle happened. Something in the middle. That is kind of uh, I did not expect it it's a little dramatic there's some some illegal secret stuff that went on oh ho, ho, yeah ho. oh and, we gotta read about this yeah see and uh-huh. that's 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 the thing something totally shocked me and I was feeling terrible 
of what was going on. Oh. But something popped up that mm-hmm. turned the story around. It turned um, it all around for yeah, you. Mainly that I found out what happened, but God kind of put me in his arms and carried me through the trial, and it ends, like I said, it started as a soap opera, but ends as a love story. Well, that was a love story. <laughs> well, that's really great. Marie Ann Memories, please. Think about the memories that she's had when you read her memoirs and what the wonderful message she has for everybody in your book. Yes, there. I want to encourage people that there's someone there. I like to say God's my best friend. He carried me through it all. It wasn't easy. Uphill and battle. Uphill battle. Uphill battle. Uphill battle. Well, thank you so much for staying. you got to come back again and oh, keep us informed of what's going oh, on. Definitely. It's, it's changing all the time. I'm looking so forward to doing this. 